Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you remember the video before last, I made sugar-free sweetened condensed milk. Now, if you watched the end of that video, you knew that I was gonna try a recipe with it and I tried it today and it came out fabulous. So I made a sugar-free key lime pie. Now guys, just so you know, this is not carb free. It's not necessarily low carb, but it is sugar free. So if you don't want to eat, you know, processed sugar, this is a really great alternative. It's made with Swerve, which is made with allulose and erythritol, which are plant-based um, sweeteners. And I'm telling you, this was so good. It has the same um, texture as just a regular key lime pie. I don't know if you can see that and um, it has just the right amount of tartness. Oh my gosh, so good. So stay tuned and I'm gonna show you how to make it. To make the crust, I'm using these Vortman shortbread zero sugar cookies, but any kind of sugar-free cookies will work. This is what they look like. And you're gonna need a couple tablespoons of the Swerve granulated sugar, six tablespoons of melted butter, now, I pulverized the cookies in the food processor. It will equal two cups. Add in my swerve and my melted butter. Then I also added a little pinch of salt. Just mix that all up until you get the consistency of wet sand. It will stick together in your fingers when you squeeze it. Now I'm using this tart pan with a removable bottom, but you can use a regular pie plate. Um, just make sure you grease it. Now don't use a deep dish, just use a regular. And I'm just patting out the crumbs here to, um, and go up all the sides. And it will look like this. Okay, and then we're going to make our filling. I have my one and a half cups of sweetened condensed milk, my four egg yolks, five tablespoons of heavy cream, half a teaspoon of vanilla, pinch of salt. Now, grate some of the zest from the lime before you squeeze it and you can decorate the top. You're gonna need a half a cup of freshly squeezed lime juice. Now you can of course use key limes, but those are hard to find, so I just used regular. Give that another quick whisk. Now I bake this for 12 minutes at 350. It's gonna take 10 to 15 minutes. And then go ahead and just pour in your filling. This turned out to be the exact right amount for the, for the shell. And then I bake this about 25 to 30 minutes. Now it's not gonna completely set. You just want the edges to be set and then the inside is still gonna, um, you don't want it runny, but it's gonna jiggle a little bit like jello. And then you're gonna refrigerate that for overnight or eight hours and this is how it comes out. You can make some sugar-free whipped topping for it, just some heavy cream with a little of the Swerve powdered sugar, granulated sugar. This was so good, you guys. I really, we, neither Chris or I could taste a big difference between this and the regular version. He had two pieces, so I know he liked it. Here's your bite. I hope you guys are gonna give this a try. It was really good and super easy. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.